In this video, I'm going to show you how to get to Nuapa Inglesia. If you're ever in the Cusco region, this is where you want to go. I guarantee you, this will be the most awe-inspiring thing you've ever seen in your life. It's worth the trip. It is an ancient site that hardly anybody knows about, and there's hardly ever any tourists there, and it's easy to get to. From Cusco, you will take a taxi to Urubamba. Uh, the taxi is going to cost you 80 to 100 solas, which is about $25. But it's a good 45 minute to an hour ride. So $25, if you're coming from the U.S., is nothing, right? For, for an hour ride and you go through the mountains, it's really picturesque. It's nice. You'll like it. There's another way you can go. You could take a colectivo, which is the local buses. And that'll cost you five solas. Five solas is like $1.50. It's a little crowded, but it's an experience. So if you're into that, take the colectivo. It's cool. From Urubamba, you'll take a taxi, tell them to take you to Naupa Inglesia. That'll cost you about 40 solas. Uh, 40 solas is, is, divide that by four is what it really is. So you divide it by four. It's cheap to get here. Here's a word of advice. You will lose cell reception. You will lose cell reception. No ifs, ands, or buts about it. You won't have it when you're here. So you have to either agree with your taxi driver to come back at a certain time and usually give them about two to three hours at least. Uh, three hours is, is plenty of time. Or look, you can just walk back. It's like 30 minutes, 40 minutes. And it's a beautiful, a beautiful walk back through this canyon right here. I've done it many times. It's good. You, you're going to like it. Once you get to the road, you hail a cab and get back to your bomba. It's easy. It's easy. But what I'm going to tell you in this video is how to get to Nuapa Inglesia from here. There's no directions. There's a certain way that you have to go. One of them's difficult and the other one is fairly easy. And I say fairly easy because there's about 500 stairs that you have to climb. <laughs> I'm gonna show you how to get there from here, all right? On the road, you're gonna see this turn off here. It's new. You'll see it, it'll be right between these two mountains here. You'll see this is one solid mountain and you'll see another one, and it's right between there. The up and is that way. We are here in Nuapa Inglesia. All right, here we are. So this is Nuapa Inglesia. We just came up by that road there, and Noapa Inglesia is right over there. Can you see the Inca ruins? We'll go up there, and behind that cliff there, behind this cliff, is a cave. We'll be going in that cave. Now, here's some advice. When you come, when you park your car there, and you're walking near the railroad tracks, these are active railroad tracks, so there will be a train coming by sometime or another. Don't walk the tracks. Just, I don't recommend it. Don't walk on this side. Walk toward the mountain on this side over here. The ruins are on this side and it's much easier than walking on those rocks. And it's only a good 200 yards up here. So it's not far. Now, here's another word of advice. If you're walking along the side here and you hear a train coming, you will hear the train coming. So don't be afraid to do this, but move over because <laughs> it's pretty close. So I would say move over as much as you can. Don't be afraid. But if you're, if you're right here, just be afraid. Just move over, just move three feet over here. <laughs> That's all I'm saying. And from here, you come up to the first, first area that you can make a right in. You can see a little sign right there. And we'll go up this hill. As you're going here, you'll see a fork in the road. You wanna go up toward the signs. So now after you get to these signs, we're going up. The air's thin up here. When you get to these stairs, you're either going to go that way, which is the hard way, or, or that way, toward the steps. Keep going up the steps. Until, until you hit here. Now these are little altars. If you guys get out of breath, just Stop for a minute, enjoy the scenery, 
I got your breath. Okay, I rested like one minute, and you can tell I caught my breath just a little bit. You'll see this, and then you'll see this. Watch this. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Those things go way up there, but they go way up there, and then they go over to the cave. That's where Nawapa and Ulysses is. So I'm gonna get up these steps. <sighs> <laughs> That's a lot of stairs. <laughs> All right. Okay, after you come up the stairs, you're going to hit a wall. Look to your right, and you'll see this walkway. Follow it. From here, you'll hit another end. You only can go one way. And it's just right up there. Look, the cage right there. We're almost there. So when you finally get to the end of the walkway, you're going to see this. This rock right here is the three seat rock. Um, you can see just a tiny little bit of, of the, uh, the doorway. And you can see these steps here. And these steps are gonna lead you to this. <laughs> and this is Noapa Inglesia. <sighs> you can see this is Inca. The Inca say this was here way before them. They don't know where this is from. And on the side of the wall, you also have this. <sighs> now I've climbed up in here. It's, it's a little dirty there, there's bats in there. There's a way out, you can go up there and, and go up to the top. Not much to see, but it's kind of neat. You'll see the bats flying around in there. Ooh, it goes all the way up here. Does it? it should go. <laughs> Be careful with those rocks. No, no, it looks pretty solid. So Lauren's up there, but she climbed from there all the way to down from in that hole. So we climbed all the way up here, and now I'm about, should I go up? Is there anything to it's see? It's pretty freaking amazing. Okay, so I'm coming up there then. I see him. I got him on video. I got him. He's spreading his wings out. I got him. I see him. They're still looking. One's looking. One's looking. Bye. Oh, oh! So, this is Nuwapa Inglesia. It's unbelievable. I hope you like this video. Be sure to subscribe. And, see this video? Watch this for some more crazy stuff. Come with me. And together, we can discover and explore Earth's ancient, strange, and unknown sites. So subscribe and come along.